Hello everyone and welcome back to Ultimate Fox Simulator and we are here with Kilala and her unexpectedly interesting mate Thistleclaw born from a fish and somewhere around here is their daughter Nettle. I have no idea where she's actually gone though. Nettle what are you doing in the water? Were you that desperate for a drink? Look at her. I can't believe that she's gotten herself all the way into the water. All right let's go over to Kilala and let's get out some food because they have a ridiculous amount of food. There we go. Got to make sure that we can feed Nettle that way. And and today we are going to be working on leveling up Kilala some more, not only so that she can have a higher chance. What are you two doing? <laughs> this look lot and Nettle seem like they're just going around in circles doing a little dance and Kilala is just like, sigh. And we are actually under the big tree den right now, which is very exciting. So we're saying this is where Thistleclaw's family originally is from. Come on, come on, can we not move? Come on, you can do it. You can do it. We've got this. We've got this. All right, here we go. Uh, but yes, we say that this gigantic tree den we are currently under is where Thistleclaw's family is from. And now Thistleclaw has brought us back home. It looks like he's having a great time. Nettle is just down there spinning in circles with her dad. So I guess Nettle is pretty excited. She is now officially an adult fox because we have gone around and we have managed. Okay, let's see if we can pull these jumps off. There we go. Let's get over to the shore. Yeah, there we go. But we have managed to get her up to level 10. So now she actually has a shot of survival uh, in case we need to go and fight anything that's really tough. Like those bears and that pure white fox. Hello, I almost ran into the jaws of death. I need to be very careful so our foxes don't die. Uh, oh good, there's just a mushroom. I can handle a mushroom at least. That's not so dangerous. But yeah, Nettle is now an adult, you guys, which means that she can hopefully survive. Jeez, you too, Nettle, get out from under. <laughs> they are so hungry. She can hopefully survive if we end up in a fight with bears or anything like that. We can roll a dice, and she has a one out of six chance of survival right now. Not very, very high, but better than nothing. Oh, and there's a carcass. Wonderful. And there's a bald eagle. Not wonderful. I try to avoid those guys. They can really, like, do some serious damage. I think I've died from bald eagles more than anything else. Like, haven't died from crocodiles, haven't died from some of the other creatures that are roaming around here, but bald eagles? Yeah, that's killed my foxes a few times. All right. Oh, and there's a little bit of food and take that. Yeah, got him. But what we're doing right now is we are trying to get Kilala up to level 20. So she has a two and six chance of surviving in case they end up getting in a fight, which is a, a bit better. You know, that's a one and three chance or oh, get it, get it, get it, Kilala. And she should be able to get her skills up higher that way too. So we can hunt easier. We can defend ourselves better. Uh, it's all about setting the specific skills that the foxes can gain as they go up levels too. And then oh, a chest. Yes. Okay. And there's some food here. Yes. Look, we just got, uh, we just got, look at this frog. This is awesome. Ah, help. What? What? No. Don't do, what? I didn't realize that the frogs would actually like work together. Look at this. Are they, are they like, is this part of the enchantment story or are they guarding this chest for some reason? All right, hey, back off guys. I don't know if these frogs are like maybe poisonous. Oh, cool, all right. So I think we just had like all of our, our needs filled. Yep, filled to the rim. And where'd the other, where'd the other frog go? I wanted to eat it. I really wanted to eat it. Ah, there it is. Man, this looks kind of fun. I kind of want to pick it up and just drag it back to our den. Wouldn't that be fun? That's what a lot of you guys have wanted us to do is start dragging them to the den and like eating at the den instead. So maybe we'll start doing that as well. But again, the other reason, squirrel, 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 we're trying to get Kilala up to level 20 is because she's ready to have another fox kit. And she needs to be up to level 20 if we want to hope to be able, let's get this. Come here, you, oh, oh man, the rats are serious business. Oh my gosh. Yeah, she needs to be up to level 20 in order to unlock the new slot so we can add in a new family member to our fox family. And it's going to be very interesting to see what our matriarch Kilala here does in order to get up to those levels. Because right now we're, we're kind of eating the mushrooms. Oh, another mushroom. Yes. Oh, it's a tiny little mushroom. I hope it's yummy for her. Maybe something to wash down the rat she just ate. Ew. Oh, and what's that? There's something over there. Uh, is that a fox or a coyote? I think that's actually a coyote because of the tail. So let's go fight it. We're gonna go fight it. We've gotta defend our area. Or maybe it's a wolf. Holy days, it's a wolf. That was not what I meant to do. Okay, come on, come on, come on. And back up. And uh, I wish we could do perfect pounds more often. 
All right, Kilala, let's just get a move on. The whole family's here. We've got to fight this wolf. All right. Ah, she didn't do the jump. Okay. All right, can we can we get it? We got it. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, wolf lovers. I'm sorry, but we're defending our territory. And Kilala, as the matriarch, which means like the female leader of the group, is doing her best to make sure that her family and her territory are defended and taken care of. And it's going to help her level up, too. So that's kind of what the fun of it is, too. Running around and just seeing what kind of... <gasps> There's another wolf! Let's take him on! Yes! And Kilala has leveled up to level 18. Only a couple more levels to go, and then she might have another baby! And a lot of you guys were like, But Siri, if you do the challenge where if a fox dies, you have to, you have to go ahead. Come on. Come on. Family, help me! Oh wow, I like danced on top of the wolf. Come on, come on. All right, we've got it. Look at him go. See, our pack is really getting stronger. All right, and let's eat up the wolf. So we're becoming like a really, really tough fox family because normally, again, there's a lot of unrealistic aspects that you just have to roll with. Normally, that wouldn't have that wouldn't have worked. That wouldn't have worked at all. But, but Kilala is becoming something else indeed. Something more than your usual your usual crafty fox. And I wonder if she wants to go back to the farmyard. Because I have to admit, eating up a bunch of farm animals is probably a good idea for her in order to put on all of the weight and all of the health that she's going to need if we're going to welcome another kit into the family. So let's go ahead and see where we are at in the map. Oh, and we're actually close to the golden... Yes, that's right. Oh, the three-tailed fox mission has come back. Kilala, you want to go fight the three-tailed fox? What? That's so dangerous. That could kill her. I say we have one more fox kit, and then we think about fighting the three-tailed fox. Because then, if she does die, what we would do is we would just, like, swap uh, the next highest fox into her position. So we would take Thistle Claw. And we would make Thistleclaw become Kilala. We would change the color. We would change the name. Does he have any points to add? I knew he doesn't. But, oh, yes, he does right here. Okay, let's add in, um, let's add in some dexterity because he's kind of slow. That should help us out quite a bit. But we would come over and we would, like, alter Thistleclaw to look like Kilala. Uh, or we would alter him to, or we would alter Kilala to look like Thistleclaw. That's what I meant to say. Because a lot of you guys are saying, but Siri, your main fox you can't release. Well, what we would do is we would just edit this fox and we would say that they leveled up a little bit to take on the burden of leadership and then we would let go of the fox that uh, we changed like we would let go of this thistle claw but we would make Kilala both the gender and the appearance of um, the old thistle claw so it sounds a little complicated it's not if you think through it and let's see let's add that and yes oh she's getting so fast let's add a bit more strength to her attacks now that should be kind of useful and it'll be really nice to have like a really highly leveled fox too with all of these special abilities because that'll make it so much easier and we do need to get Daddle up because right now she's just kind of exposed to so much danger but what would happen then if we lost Kilala is possibly Nettle would end up taking her place so if we do lose a fox as sad as that is don't forget you guys that does mean that then we would actually be able to have more kits we would be able to fight other foxes and then invite them into our pack so we're limited on our pack number so although it sounds really sad and taking on the big challenges of trying to fight something like a bear may be a bit of a bad idea if we want our foxes to survive it also is a good idea for the sake of the story so I just hope that makes sense because I know so many of you were so sweet and you were so worried about our foxes all right so there should be a golden mushroom like right over here for Thistleclaw. So let's go ahead and let Thistleclaw try to find this golden mushroom really quickly. Because it should be, like, we should be right on top of it. Somewhere in the gloom. Somewhere lost in this, in this fog. He should find, he should find a golden mushroom. Yes, I would like to find the golden mushroom. <laughs> Where is it? Thistleclaw, why do you always have the things that are difficult? Why can't you just, like, stumble on it? It should literally be right here. This is what happened last time, too. The golden mushroom wasn't exactly where we thought it would be. And so Thistleclaw had to really do a lot of sniffing around the area to try to find it. And just as I was like, oh, it must not, it must not exist. We stumbled on it. Is that it? Way over here? No, that's just a normal mushroom. <laughs> All right, Thistleclaw, eat it and taste what mushroom tastes like. And then I guess go ahead and, and praise. Oh, he's praising his daughter. That's so sweet. Or maybe she's praising him. I feel like Thistleclaw and Kilala still have a bit of a relationship to figure out. All right, can't see a thing, so let's turn on night vision. Oh, you guys, I don't know about this. Maybe we should go look in a different area right now. 
because it's foggy and dark at night and Thistleclaw is going to be so frustrated trying to hunt down these golden mushrooms. Maybe it was a tale that his great-grandmother, a very, very, very old, old and highly respected wise fox when he was just a kit, told him about that eating the golden mushrooms could bring prosperity to your pack. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. What is that? Is that a bald eagle? Yeah, we're not going to go that direction. All right, so let's go over here then. So Thistleclaw is trying to find <laughs> these mushrooms. Okay, we'll have to look for the mushrooms. We'll go this way and I'll let Thistleclaw lead until there's some food to eat because Kilala, as the the main leader matriarch who's expecting a fox kit, gets to go first. Um, oh wow, there's a lot of animals over there. Hmm, we might end up getting in a big fight. We'll have to see. All right, I really don't want to pick a fight with bears. Is that just like bear country? How many bears? One, two, three, four. Is that a bear over there? Oh gosh, the fog just went away for a second. Do you think we could isolate that bear? Like run up and tag it and then run off with it? Cause that's, is that what you want to do Kilala? Seriously? Hmm. I don't know. Cause I think once you make one bear angry, all the other bears start following you. But maybe we can kind of like lead the bear away. They're very strong. Oh, she's done it. She's done it. Kilala, what have you done? Kilala. Kilala, get far, far, far away from the bear. Okay. Oh my gosh. Okay. This was a bad idea. This was a very bad idea. And because it's bigger than us, I don't think we can actually attack it. Oh my gosh, Kilala, stop dashing all over the place. I can't see a thing. All right, can we get it? Can we get it? Kilala's really hungry. What you're seeing right now is a very, very hungry wolf. Oh, or wolf fox. I meant fox. You guys know that. Sorry, I was so distracted. We did it. We took out the bear. I really thought that was a bad decision and I was going to regret everything about my life. And thankfully, thankfully, she's okay. I really thought that was going to be the end of it. And her family is okay. So now we know how we can fight some bears, you guys. You just want to kind of lead them to the side and then you want to go after them. And I should have turned on our abilities. Sorry, I was just so nervous. I think Kilala really wants to go. She wants to fight in bear country. So let's see. I think I saw another bear over here. We do not want to get like three bears chasing us. That would be very bad indeed. What? Are they right next to our house? We went in a big circle around our den. Oh, this isn't this isn't the way it goes. We're not letting a bunch of bears move in on our den space. All right, so let's see. We're going to take a little peek over here. Let's see if we can find the next bear and isolate it. Um, can I eat this food? Oh, 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 it's going to see us. We're going to fight over this. Okay, you guys ready for this? All right, jump Kilala. You've got this. And then dodge. Jump and dodge, Kilala. Oh my gosh, look at Nettle go! Look at Nettle go! Nettle's right in on this. Why aren't they helping? Come on, family. That's right, come on. Kilala's almost got this. Come on, I need your help. Yes, all right. There we go, you guys. And Kilala just picked it up. She just tried to pick the entire bear up. She's very hungry. Yeah, the experience, I think, from defeating it is pretty good. And, well, we got it away from our territory, and that's a good thing. I didn't think Kilala is really getting sassy. I guess we would be almost ready once she has the next kit. I think we would be ready to go ahead and... Oh, look at, look at Nettle. She's like, I'm so full. All right, good job, Nettle. I'm very proud of you. You did a wonderful job. In fact, maybe that's what we should do. We should celebrate after we do like a really big fight like that by leveling up a lot just with snuggling. So you could just have like a, a peaceful, you could have just like a purely peaceful pack of foxes if you really wanted to, or excuse me, a leash of foxes if you really wanted to. Cause you could just say, okay, after we, we fight, we snuggle, like you only level up through snuggling with the other foxes. <laughs> over and over and over again and you only eat mushrooms and maybe beetles that you dig out into the ground and maybe the stuff from the farm and nothing else so you could do that if you really wanted to but I don't know if that's what we're gonna do Kilala is coming out to be a lot more of a fighter who knows maybe Nettle may see her mother die in some future battle and she'll be dedicated to only eating the berries off of the farm 
and only having to like get the farm dog in line every now and then. Who knows? Who knows what'll happen? That's one of the fun things about this. I don't know where the story is going to go. But Kilala is actually getting a lot closer, thankfully. Oh, where have we moved? <gasps> it's Bora country, you guys. All right, you ready for this? Na 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 na. Come on, buddy. Perfect pounce, please. Why can't I get you? All right. Yes! And down we go. Food! All right, and I think Kilala is very, very proud of her dexterity because she ends up t pouncing on so many things like that. So good job, you guys. I will actually, I will go ahead and praise Thistleclaw. And Nettle has, uh, she sent something interesting over here. So we'll go investigate over there too. All right, I'm actually really proud of how much they're doing. We're starting to take on some of the bigger and stronger creatures. Nettle has become an adult and has worked very, very hard to be able to get to the point she's at. Oh, look, she's almost leveled up. Let's let her just snuggle with her mom and, and kind of like be praised by her mom for like all of the work she's been doing and almost... Yes! All right. And now Nettle is up to level 11. So Thistleclaw may really need a little bit of attention pretty soon. Where are you going, Kilala? Are you that hungry? Kilala is taking this seriously, you guys. She wants some food. She must be very, very, very hungry as an expectant mother and just doesn't have any time to like mess around right now. She wants to go ahead and eat everything she needs to. So there we go. All right. Good job. Good job, everybody. And I think, Kilala, have I assigned all of your points? Yes, we have. And Thistleclaw, have we assigned all of his points? I don't think he's leveled up yet. Yes, we have. And Nettle just leveled up. So yes. All right. She has a buff upgrade and she has increased attack speed. So we're going to add duration onto that. And I think that should be everything she's got. Yep. All right. So next time we come back, we will continue feeding very, very hungry Kilala because she is starving and she wants to go ahead and uh, get ready to have her babies. Another baby at least. And then I guess after we have the next fox kit, we may go and battle with the three-tailed fox because I feel like they're starting to get strong enough for that. And I'm, I'm curious about Thistleclaw. He used to be such a hothead and ever since Nettle was born, he's calmed down. But I almost wonder if he's too calm. I wonder if he now is like having a crisis of confidence because he can't even find some mushrooms. What kind of, what kind of guy can't even find some mushrooms? Is someone fighting? Kilala, what the heck? Okay, uh, Thistleclaw. Okay, well, look, he does he's not even needed for this. Nettle and Kilala handled everything. <laughs> so I wonder if Thistleclaw is kind of having a crisis of confidence at the moment. We'll have to find that out, and I will see you guys next time. Bye-bye.